Aquatex Biomod line of wastewater treatment and zero liquid discharge systems provide modular, end-to-end -end solutions to a broad range of industries, our expanded granular sludge bed technology sets a higher bar in anaerobic wastewater treatment. EGSB is a closed reactor, with all necessary instrumentation installed to ensure safety and smooth operations. It gives consistent product quality regardless of COD concentration hydraulic load variance. The system broadly consists of a feed mixing tank, chemical dosing systems, biogas handling system, and EGSB reactor. The untreated water enters the feed mixing tank along with recirculation flow. The required nutrition levels and pH is maintained by an automatic chemical dosing system. This mixture is fed to the bioreactor through a specially designed arrangement to ensure proper mixing with anaerobic biomass. A series of reactions like hydrolysis, acetogenesis, methanogenesis are initiated with the help of this biomass, converting COD into biogas. Settler 1 prevents escape of large sludge particles along with the liquid flow. Large sludge particles return to the bottom where they mix with the granulated sludge bed. The upward moving water enters Settler 2, which is proprietary design settler for separation of biogas. Here, biogas is separated from the liquid and fine sludge particles. The biogas then enters the final settler, 3, which acts as a polisher to retain fine solids and separate traces of gas. It pushes the biogas upward and retains fine sludge particles that try to escape with the product water. Biogas is collected at the top of the reactor and it leaves the reactor to be used for generating green energy. EGSB's optimized sludge settler design, optimum upflow velocity operation and expanded granular biomass maximizes contact between sludge and organic pollution to achieve higher performance efficiencies. Biomod EGSB's proprietary multi-settler reactor design enables high sludge retention, resulting in better sludge granulation to improve overall process performance and to make energy neutral or energy positive process conditions and lower operating costs.